Benign acanthosis nigricans is typically seen in younger individuals and is associated with insulin resistance states such as diabetes mellitus, obesity, and polycystic ovarian syndrome. Increased levels of insulin or insulin-like growth factors are told to stimulate epidermal and dermal proliferation. Similarly, skin tags, which you can see here, are pedunculated outgrowths of normal skin are also commonly present on regions affected by acanthosis nigricans. Malignant acanthosis nigricans is associated with underlying neoplasms, especially of the gastrointestinal and genitourinary tracts. The sudden appearance of such skin changes in middle age or elderly patients is suggestive of underlying malignancy. In addition, these patients are not obese but instead may have lost weight and lesions can occur in uncommon areas such as mucosal membranes, palms and soles. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to watch our signs of diabetes video and see you on the next video.